Getting started with Showed Me can be done easily by following a few basic instructions. You will receive a text message with a link to the website, along with your email and password to log in. You must use the email and password we give you. You cannot use your own. The password is case sensitive. You must enter the capital letters exactly as we gave you, or you won't be able to log in. If you have any questions, please feel free to access the live chat option on your screen. You can also email support at showed.me. Upon login to the system, you should see any training items under your to-do list. Click on those items to accept them and get started. Once you're taken into your learning path, you will see the overview on the left and a list of steps to complete in the middle column. You'll start with a completion percentage of 0%, and as you complete each step, that number will change. As you begin going through each step, whether a video, document, etc., you must remember to click the Complete Step icon in order to track your progress. As you click this icon, a green check will appear for that step. If you do not see the Complete Step icon, that's either because your step may have a timer that has not yet run out, or the video is still playing. Wait until the timer and video are over in order for the Complete Step button to be enabled. There will likely be a quiz step in our learning path to show that you're retaining the information that you're learning. You may be asked several questions where you'll be required to select the most appropriate answer. You'll be able to review your score at the end and may even be able to retake it if you're not satisfied with the results. Once you're done with all of the steps in your learning path, you'll likely need to add your signature as the last step. It'll ask you to do so electronically. This signature shows that you have successfully completed your learning path and you'll be able to view your certificate at any later time. It'll remain in your profile so that you or your agency can view it too. It can be printed as well, depending on you or your agency's preference. Here is a sample of a completion certificate. A nurse or DPS will sign it from your agency. You may be asked to sign it electronically as well. Once you're done, you're good to go until the next item on your to-do list is sent to you. This will depend on your agency's requirements. Good luck!